Hello and welcome to the Admiral Studios. My name is Joel and today I'm here to talk to you about the Admiral Freedom Rigging System. Now, this system consists of multiple parts and I'm going to explain a little bit about each one for you now. First, we have our single rigger, which is used for single fixtures. Makes sense? Next, we have the down rigger, which is used for multiple fixtures in a single location. And lastly, we have our floor rack, which is a self-standing apparatus used for multiple fixtures. We also have the bonus component, the drop arm set, and that is used for moving heads. Allow me to bring in the table and I'll show you each of the components that make up these sets. Now, as you can see here, I've laid out all the components used to make our freedom rigging sets. We have our length profiles and normally, of course, not for the single rigger, but for the rest of them, you need two length profiles, which are ranging from half a meter, a meter, a meter and a half, two meters, a freedom hanger or many freedom hangers, coupler set, and a nut plate set. In this video, I'm going to talk to you a little bit more about the Admiral Downrigger and its applications. Now, when assembling your Admiral Downrigger, the first thing you'll notice is these holes along the length profile. Now, these are the places where your length profile can accommodate a Freedom Hanger. So, you will line up your length profile with the hanger, insert your bolt on the side, and turn the knob to lock your Freedom Hanger in place. Now that I've attached both my Freedom Hangers to our length profiles, all that's left to do is attach a coupler via the nut plate set to the length profile, and you're ready to hang your downrigger to the truss. For more information on our nut plate set, please see our single rigger video. Thanks for watching our video about the downrigger. Be sure to check out our other videos on the floor rack and the single rigger and drop arm.